uh, we are getting out of Vientiane again uh, by uh, a uh, truck uh, on the way. Just at the uh, edge of Vientiane, we decided to get our lunch, Kaoji or Bami. And then I should call it uh, Kaoji Pate. Uh, so it's a sandwich with a pate. Oh, she's making one. There's still sausage over here. Pork rind. Sure, I'll try anything. Oh, no, not that. That's fine. I don't need that. <laughs> that looks like a Japanese sandwich. <laughs> Uh, this is a man, that's the, like a fermented uh, pork sausage type of a product and some bread sweets and this, I don't know how to describe it, it's like a shredded and dry meat product and I, I don't even know the name but it's uh, quite good I, and usually they put it in the Kaoji uh, Pate. condensed milk uh, that's our favorite carnation brand right there and of course you gotta have a little shrine or, or miniature temple on your property for good luck and a uh, 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 successful business And this is our Toyota Hilux truck. Uh, we're riding in this to get to a Namgum, uh, uh, Gum River again, um, uh, to, to see, uh, I believe, a uh, very large, newly constructed dam. Um, they said the, uh, the dam has a uh, hydro uh, generator plant. Uh, so it can, the single dam can provide all the uh, electricity needed for the entire house and, and plus some uh, enough electricity to export to the neighboring country. So I'm looking forward to that. Looks like, looks like our sandwich is ready. Look at this, the pile of sandwich and I need to chase the flies away. <laughs>
So they have different sizes of the bread. This is the smallest one. You can see the uh, one on the right, the smallest one. Uh, after you know, putting uh, all the ingredients in, at one dollar. And the medium size over here. Medium size over here is two dollars. And this giant bread over here, one sandwich is ten dollars. But still, it's a, it's a big deal. So this is the Laotian style iced coffee. First you fill the bag with ice, pour some uh, condensed milk in there, and then uh, just push the blue coffee, uh, pour it into the bag, and then they are, they are gonna seal the bag. Let's watch uh, how she does it. Alright, now it's mixing up. Then put it in the paper bag to, to uh, stabilize it so you can actually stand it up. And then, then poke the hole with a straw and there we go. Giant cup of ice coffee. Hello everyone, this is Kinju again. Uh, we uh, came to a uh, a place high up in the mountain called Ban Palat, uh, it's, which is uh, probably two hours outside of Vientiane. And uh, um, uh, this is upstream of Gun River, Namgun. And uh, we have a big dam, yeah, the largest dam uh, with the hydro power plant attached to it. And uh, we're gonna check this out right now. So that structure over there is the dam, and uh, there's a lot of water. So the uh, looks like we are the. Uh, downstream of the dam the water is coming this way so the uh, what the, the the other side of that uh, concrete structure is the dam holding a lot more water and then they uh, made this place very uh, beautiful with uh, landscaping I see uh, palm trees and many different kinds of flowers including the um, uh, lantana that attracts, always attracts butterflies. And there is a beautiful uh, arbor arcade. Maybe we can walk through. And looks like it, this one is a bougainvillea. Very nice. And papaya tree, the baby papaya tree right here. And a little uh, coffee shop, coffee stand. This is actual uh, river banks. And so this is about a two hour drive from uh, uh, capital, Vientiane capital. And, but still, uh, I was told that uh, this location is still within uh, Vientiane province. It's a beautiful place, beautiful water. Not muddy like a Mekong because it's upstream. So now we are 
looking down on the uh, the dam lake of uh, Namgum. Namgum can hang like that. Why you know like that? We are in a restaurant uh, that is built right on the water, the dam lake of Namgun. And this is the view from the window. And again, uh, there's no glass in the window, uh, natural air conditioning, but it's nice and comfortable today. It's not too hot. And uh, obviously, there's a uh, boat tour available uh, leaving from this pier or piers. I see a couple of them. And the lake view this way that's quite big they hold a lot of uh, water and in the distance I can see it's raining so that will keep filling this uh, uh, dam lake and good for allow uh, water for everything and also for power generation okay so we decided to uh, um, get a boat to our group uh, chartered boat the cost of that is about just about 20 US dollars per hour and we're going to uh, spend two hours on the water so that's gonna be like a forty dollars for all of us to enjoy this view and that's gonna be awesome so thank you Nah, it's okay. Now I'm on the boat and it's just started to rain, so uh, it's very nice and cool and comfortable. And this is what uh, the, the restaurant looks like from down here. And that's just uh, you know, halfway up the mountain. And other boats are docked. And uh, I can see the mountains around the dam lake. It's raining and cool. This is gonna be a wonderful experience. And we have our bunch right here. Looks like they are ready to party. Let's see how it goes. It started rain, so uh, they decided to uh, pull the curtain to protect us from the rain. And this boat is well equipped. Now we have some food. They're fast. We just ordered this food out there in the restaurant. And within, I would say, 10 minutes, everything looks like you're ready. That's awesome. Very fast. And it is not like a exactly uh, fast food. It's like a grilled fish, steamed fish, and this is uh, a uh, fish soup. It looks like a great food all around. Awesome. And, and mix it with uh, with a uh, um, what is this mint and uh, other herbs. I see uh, I see chopped up uh, long green beans and, and 
I have some lemongrass in there and of course uh, Thai chili pepper sitting on top. Then we got a uh, tamufum, a uh, green papaya salad. You gotta have those in this country at every meal, I guess. And we have uh, fresh herbs and cucumbers. And Bangalore, what is this one? Three banana, mushroom, mushroom, and fried, deep fried and mix. Okay, Mush mushroom and deep fried. Deep fried mushroom. And over there is a steamed fish. Awesome. And it looks like uh, fried rice in there. Yes, fried Okay, very good. That's our lunch. Bon appetit.
On our way back from uh, Namgum Dam, we stopped at uh, Taidam village. So uh, the people uh, who live here are different tribe from uh, Lao people. These are Taidam people, Taidam tribe. And during the Vietnam War, these people were chased off from their homeland in Vietnam by the uh, Vietnam uh, communists in the North Vietnam. And then, then so these people were sort of a victim of the ethnic cleansing in, during the Vietnam War time. And then instead of uh, um, staying in the Vietnam to uh, risk their lives, they escaped. The entire village, entire tribe escaped to Laos. And then so in this uh, section of Laos, um, Taidong people settled down. And then now this is the village and then they have uh, established a market here. And it's very similar to nothing is different from a Lao market. Uh, their lifestyle now is the same as Laotians and uh, the Laotian government encouraged Taidam people and Lao people to uh, uh, unite in, in, uh, in everything, in every aspect of their life and there is no disadvantage to, to be for being a Taidam tribe member. Okay, so now it's time to uh, head back to Vientiane capital from Taidam village.